Brian, I love this house. It is a million dollars with the interest rates a little bit higher. I just don't know if I can afford it. I just really need to wait until interest rates dip. You know, I don't know, maybe a year per se. What do you think about that, Brian? Let's look into some of the numbers. Let's assume we've got a million dollar house where you're gonna put 20% down, so $200,000 down today, and you have an interest rate of 6.58%, which is actual interest rates as of about August 7th, 2020. 24. Your monthly payment, if you were to buy that house today, would be $6,274. Now, let's say you wait about a year. That same house is actually increased in value because the interest rates dipped a little bit. Let's say the interest rates down to 5.58. That million dollar house not only has increased in value over the year, but there's more competition. More competition will drive up that price. So let's say that purchase price is now a million seventy-five thousand dollars. So seventy-five thousand dollars more one year later. Like I said, we have an interest rate of five point five eight. Now your down payment at twenty percent is now actually two hundred fifteen thousand versus two hundred thousand, and your overall monthly payment would be six thousand one hundred and eighty-nine dollars. So yes you will be saving $85 a month by waiting that extra year when the interest rates dip by 1%, but you will also need to put down $15,000 more than today. And the purchase price of that house is about $75,000 more for a grand total of 90,000. So 90,000 or $85 a month. Oh, and you can always refinance here in a year or two. Seems pretty clear to me, but it's a very common question, understandable, but just look at the numbers on each potential place you're looking at and don't let the market scare you. Thanks.